Unsolved 2000. The case of 33-year-old Frank Burley. Frank Burley was shot on the night of Friday the 14th of April 2000 in Sugarwell Road, Meanwood. It was thought that he had been shot by an accomplice that he had been out with, who had shot him as he had slipped and fell. It was said that they had been out on a punishment raid, and just before Frank Burley was shot, a 17-year-old youth was shot in the leg. After the shooting, the man said that he saw Frank Burley's accomplice run past his drive. He said that he had been helping visitors into a taxi at the time, and saw the accomplice run down the street at 100 miles an hour, waving a gun. The man said that the accomplice seemed to be in control, and had shouted, Get out of my way! at him. Frank Burley had just been released six months earlier from prison after having been sentenced to 14 years, of which he served nine years for armed robbery and hostage taking, and it was thought that he had been attempting to re-establish his position in Leeds and had been putting the squeeze on local drug dealers. It was said that he would never get involved in drugs himself, but was not adverse to taxing local druggies and taking their money, knowing that they would never complain to the police. His earlier conviction was in relation to a failed £147,000 armed raid at a Blackpool jewellers in which he had held a 17-year-old woman and the woman's 52-year-old daughter at gunpoint for nine hours whilst besieged by the police. Frank Burley's murder was one of seven shootings around Leeds that month. It was also heard that a price had been put on Frank Burley's head by his rivals who had flourished whilst he had been in prison. Frank Burley had been known as the King of New York due to his notoriety. He was also known as Frank Gatt. Nothing more is known about who shot him or why, and his death remains a mystery to this day.